woods are lovely, dark and deep, but I have a promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep and miles to go before I sleep. Beloved friends, the only dream of my life is to be very useful and very productive to the mankind and I have chosen a path to learn and to impart that learnings to the millions of the people and inspire them to believe in their greatness, the greatness of the power of their mind. Let them believe that they can do whatever they want in life because they are blessed with the power of the mind. Whatever the mind can conceive and believe, the mind can really achieve for them. If they have set a definite goal in life, if they are willing to go extra mile with tremendous belief and faith, realizing that they are an equal temper of heroic heart, seeking, finding, striving for different plans and executing them with determination, failing every time but still not giving up, falling several times but bouncing back tremendous energy and enthusiasm, and taking the challenges, taking the bulls by the horn, facing all the hurdles, impediments, reverses, adversities, difficulties, knowing that these are the natural process, because there is no such reality as something for nothing. If you want to achieve certain things in life, in proportion to that object you have to pay the price. And these people are bound to be successful. But beloved friends, remember it. Sometimes it becomes very difficult because things are not easily attained. You are being tested very tremendously. You are meeting with granite wall. You know, the oppositions are tremendous and determined to stop you. But there comes the power of will. Your determination, your perseverance and persistent continual action, despite of all the reverses, never saying die, never giving up, taking the bulls by the horn, trading down all difficulties and danger. And once the purpose is fixed, then victory or death, do or die, win or perish, because you have burnt all the breezes, you have left no scope for any retreat. Such persons are bound to be successful and great in life. Beloved friends, here is the turning point. I know so many people, they are ambitious, they are following the path of all success principles with a definite purpose, with courage, conviction, belief and faith, marching forward, but they are sometimes discouraged and disappointed. I let you know that this will make you disintegrated, disorganized, discouraged, demotivated, and you will be just forced to quit because human courage has also limitations. But that's why, you know, at the top, it is not very crowded. Only very few select greats can reach that great heights of dizziness because they have the courage to undergo all sorts of suffering, sorrows, pains of the journey of greatness. If you want to be really great, remember one great poem, Invictus, written by one of the greatest poets of England. William Ernest Henley. His life was full of sorrow, suffering and miseries, but he started believing in himself and he really challenged even God and he said, and I read his poem, please get me inspired from his poem. Out of the night that covers me, black as a pit from pole to pole, I thank whatever gods may be, for my unconquerable soul. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced or cried aloud. Under the bludgeoning of chance, my head is bloody but unbowed. Beyond this place of wrath and tears looms but the horror of this shed. Yet the menace of the years finds and shall find me unafraid. It matters not how I state the gate, how charged with punishment they scroll. I am the master of my fate, 
and I am the captain of my soul. Beloved friends, your great thoughts of invincible determination, courage and conviction, tending towards the definite purpose of your life, never minding any obstacles, just moving forward, keeping your eyes front and head high, and believing that you are bound to be successful. You can really come flying colors. But there you need the courage. There you need the belief and the faith that I can do it because life's battle don't always go to the strong or the fastest man. But sooner or later, the one who wins is the one who thinks one can. Bargain with your life not for penny. Demand from yourself. Whatever you want, you will get it. But you have to pass the acid test. The path to greatness and success are very difficult. We don't have wings, we cannot soar. But we have feet to escape and climb. By slow degrees and more and more, the cloudy summits of our time. Also, beloved friends, hearts by great men reached and kept, were not attained by sudden flight, but they, while their companions slept, were toiling upward in the night. I let you know, don't be discouraged. Be brave. Be not impatient in delay, but wait. And as one who understands, when his spirit rises and commands, the gods are ready to obey. Yeah, God help those who help themselves. Be brave. Be courageous. Never be disappointed. Never be discouraged. Pray God always. The infinite intelligence will come for your rescue. And you yourself are the incarnation of almighty strength, power, willpower, dog determination, and you can conquer. You are invincible. You are the master of men among men. You yourself, the master of your fate, the captain of your soul, the builder of your life, the creator of the congenial circumstances, situations, and everything what you want. You will be what you will to be. Believe in yourself. And I thank you very much for being such a great man.